Hello everyone, I have some examples and notes for page 196, 11 through 20. So your first example, natural log of a is equal to five. Solve, we're solving for each variable here. In order to solve for a, we're going to make the base of e on both sides. So e to the power of natural log a is equal to e to the power of five. The e and natural log cancel out. So that means that a is equal to e to the power of five. Next one. So now we have negative nine times the natural log of b, or negative nine times log base 10 of b equals negative 81. You're gonna start with division, divide both sides by negative nine. Log base 10 of b is equal to nine. Okay. And then to finish solving, when there's not a base written here, that mean, that technically means it's of base 10. So now we're going to make an exponent of 10 here, um, or a base number of 10 on both sides here to cancel this log base 10 out. So 10 to the power of this equals 10 to the power of 9. The 10 and log base 10 cancel out, so b is equal to 10 to the power of 9. Okay, natural log of negative 7 equals C. Uh, you cannot take the natural log of 0 or a negative number. So this one is just going to be no solution because this uh, negative 7 is negative. Next one. We have 2 plus 5 times, times the natural log of 3D equals 17. We always, so the process we use undo addition or subtraction your next step is going to be to undo multiplication and then after that you undo the natural log or logarithms so start with subtraction we're going to subtract two from both sides five natural log of 3d equals 15 divide both sides by five natural log of 3d equals um, Three. Now we're going to undo the natural log. Okay, make the base of E. So you have 3D is equal to E to the power of 3. And now to finish, we're going to divide by 3 to get D all along. D is equal to E to the power of 3 divided by 3. Okay, same process as before. We're going to undo our addition first. So we're gonna subtract 17 from both sides. 30 natural log of 8x equals 60. Then we do division. We're gonna divide both sides by 30. Natural log of 8x equals two. Then we're gonna take both sides with a base of e. The e and natural log cancel out, so you get 8x equals e squared. And then finally, we're going to divide both sides by 8 to get x alone. Okay, next example here. 40 plus 400 log base 4 of g equals 840. Subtract, so we undo subtraction addition. Then after that, we undo multiplication and division. Then we undo the natural logs or logarithms. Okay, so we're going to subtract 40 from both sides. We have 400 log base 4 of g equals 800 divided by 400. Log base 4 of g is equal to 2. Now it's base 4, so we're going to have a base of 4 like this. 4 and log base 4 cancel each other out, so g equals 4 squared. which is equal to 16. Next one. Okay, this one, you have to undo the multiplication and then the log base three. So divide both sides by 4,000. Log base three of K is equal to six. And then 
to undo this log base three, you're going to make three a base number. So the three and log base three cancel each other out. So K equals three to the power of six. Okay, I, if you have, so this is negative 17 log base zero of J equals negative 51. This is going to be no solution. You cannot have a base of zero. And one more problem here. Okay, log base three of m to the power of five equals 40. So this five is an exponent. Remember your power rule. This five can go down out front. Five log base three of m equals 40. Now we're just going to divide both sides by five. Log base 3 of m equals 8. Take both sides with a base of 3. 3 to the power of this is equal to 3 to the power of 8. The 3 and log base 3 cancel each other out, so m is equal to 3 to the power of 8.